Ricky, where should we go game hunt? Hmm, how about Arkansas? All right, we're in Texas now for an hour and a half, and then to Arkansas, Ricky. Then our dreams yeah. will come true. Look at that shirt, though. <laughs> Ricky, where are we? We're in Arkansas. We made it, Lena, Hawaii, <laughs> Arkansas earlier. Adam and Retro Rick. Guys, we have a mission today with a, Good a, Lord, a, a, a contest in mind. We have to find an animated VHS, a Looney Tunes related item, and a cartridge based game. First one to get all three gets to keep all of Retro Rick's earnings tonight on whatnot. Let's go look! <laughs> Just kidding, the actual prize is each of us has to put in $10, winner takes all. Let's go. Get your video I got here. mine. Is that from the 90s though? Is, is it from the 90s? 90s one? Dang it, are any yeah. of these ones from the... We gotta look at dates now on these, because some of these released before the 90s, but they have to be coming out in the 90s. The challenge isn't just to see them, you have to buy them, and you just left this behind, so I got my first sure. item. Rick just left this behind, like a thing. You have to buy it, you idiot. You are so stupid. I don't know if I want this to be my thing. It's too big, because at least the VHS I can take back home with me. This I can't. Ricky, this is like super cool. Disney babies. Look at that though. I love it. I mean, 25 firm if I wasn't flying. This is so cool, Rick. You see this? Look, Ricky, what I got down here. A little bit of Xena Warrior Princess. I just bought a Xena Warrior Princess uh, single stitch shirt. shirt. Dude, I'll never get one of these <laughs> from my kids. Dang it, my kids don't love me. Oh, I thought this was a nativity scene down here. Definitely not a nativity scene. Ricky, let's see this blockbuster sign though down here. I know Rick was looking at that, but this is a blockbuster sign. Oh my gosh, look at that. I mean, honestly, if we didn't fly from California, this is like an easy thing. It's 25% off and it's only $95. So what's 25% off of that? Like 70 bucks, something like that. Random talk, my mom would love this. And this is my mom's favorite singer of all time right here. You know Patsy Klein, bro? Patsy Klein is where it's at. Adam just pulled this out. <laughs> And I know Rick likes it, but I saw him say it first, so I'm totally gonna buy this. A Bendum's Page Master, bro. Oh, oh, are you sad? Yeah. You wanted it, honestly, you can have it. <laughs> in your dreams, bro. <laughs> oh. you that in your bag? You Guess I, I don't have a bag. Uh, fun fact, my um, luggage was lost, and I don't have one right now. So we're hoping they find them. Oh my god. Actually, it's not my size. No, it's a yeah, double. It's a small. We're gonna stroll through some. I know not all of you love shirts as we see every time, so I won't make you watch me flip through all these. I'm gonna come back to you guys after I give it a peek. So I'm gonna look through. Let's see. All right, y'all. I found my first shirt. XL single stitch Sylvester Stallone. Uh, wow, Sylvester Stallone. What the heck is this guy saying? Sylvester Stallone. <laughs> I call him Sylvester Stallone. <laughs> I love the little pocket hit. Embroidered hits are good. Dude, it's 25% off. I'm in. No, I'm in. That's actually sick, bro. Droop, I never see Droop. What size either. is that? Get that OxyClean and get that out. Yeah, you can get that out. No, what size? It's like a... Bro, you can shrink that, dog. They call you Shrinky yeah. Ricky for no reason, bro. <laughs> Rick, what is Disney's Dolphins in the Depth? Look at this vintage shirt. It's the Walt Disney World hit, too. It looks old. I don't know what that is. I've okay. never heard of that. I like your hat, though. <laughs> I won. <laughs> You're buying it, bro? Yes. I don't know if you guys know this, but I have a store now. This oh, is like working. You're actually buying this. Of course. I think Dude, it's that's sick, bro. Okay. For 70 bucks? Yeah, that's silly. I mean, it's double-sided, too. I, 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 oh, it is double-sided, but honestly, this is just everything. Oh, a cartridge game. That was on the list. Cartridge game. Only one, but it's a game. How much is, it, how much is this? I'd like to check out what this game, please. How many of those do they have, Ricky? Yeah, Chippendales, yeah, Donald Duck. I mean, to be honest, buy more of those Chippendales. Those are the, my favorite ones, dude. Look, it's double, so there's you, two of them on You here. never see those. Punisher, Ricky. Ghost Rider. Oh, that's the cart you brought? I feel like you can fit oh. more in my, in, my, in my pocket. 101 donations. There was an NES game over there. Hey, card game. I know, I got it. Oh uh, yeah, bro, I win. Get that camera out of my face. I appreciate it, but don't talk. Right. Ricky passed on this, so I'm totally picking it up. Ricky, I cannot believe you passed on it, but I'm gonna make it in the car. Even when we're not in California, Ricky, ready? Ricky, I got this. Dude, like that, in life, in life. You see this? It's a Goosebumps dummy, bro. I mean, they're probably this is probably from the Toy Story version, but this is what it looked like, right? Night of the Living Dummy? Isn't this what he looked like? Uh, it's similar. His mouth bit. came open. Dude, you guys, I have the fattest Woody right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's awesome, dude. 
That is so sick. $38. I mean, that doesn't seem like too crazy. Oh, look at this. I'm all about this right here. That is awesome. But look, he doesn't want to tell us about the deals. He's like, shh, it's between us. So it's interesting. I've actually been looking for these blow molds, Rick. My friend Jillian has been looking for these and was like, please find them for me, the old blow mold sets. They're like $800 where we live in California, Ricky. Oh my gosh. Look at this, California raisin vintage uh, child. This is actually this is actually what the Pee Wee Herman uh, child costume box came in, the same box. I feel like 14 bucks is on, look. I'm putting it on. Rick was over there like talking to himself and I see him kind of wigging out and freaking out. And then I'm like, what is he buying? What is he buying? They're like, oh, that's cool. That's cool. And I look over and it's this crazy ghost thing. No, I'm just kidding. It's this <laughs> Salvation Army. Okay, Rick, I'm gonna be honest with you. The biggest difference in California, Arkansas, that would have a zero on it yeah. and still not enough. It is 95 firm. I'm, I'm honestly very I surprised so how much cheaper stuff that places like this are. In California, they're highly overpriced. Nice job, Rick. Ricky, we can make our first joke. I Arkansas this. They got like the whole set here. These are, oh, sing me a Bible song. Rick, sing me a Bible song. And you got these, super rad. Good grief. Ricky just found this right underneath us. How much is that? 30 bucks? I think you should buy it, Ricky. Hello? Hello? Yeah, should he buy it? 100%. Be honest, he's your friend. I think you need to buy it. Ricky's buying. We're buying everything today, boys. Uh-oh, look what I see here. Sonic the Hedgehog comic. It's only one, Ricky, but look at Back to the Future, Doctor Who, G.I. Joe, Ghost Rider, Invader Zim, Kick Booty, Jugger, Lady Death Predator, and so much more. <laughs> They got this from uh, the Pawn Stars store. It says from Pawn Stars and it has the gold and silver pawn shop logo on it, on the back. Mm, from Pawn Stars. Know. They even have a couple signs lying around. Look at this, they got the old standees and these are from episode one, two, and three because they're from the 90s. This one's from Force Awakens and it makes it not near as cool, but the R2 and C3PO are sick. Ooh, an X-Men TV tray? I think it's roached. How much is this though? $8.95. That's really cool, Rick. Should I get this? Yeah. It's only eight bucks. I would do it. Marvel Morris, he's looking, he's looking at his shirt. Adam, Adam, Adam. You guys are supposed to start chanting with me. Adam, hey. Adam. We knew when he was walking up, Mr. Marvel Morris, mm -hmm. you're gonna buy it? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, take it home, baby. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's a vintage Mickey hat, bro. You look a little egghead though with it on. Why are you being you mean, bad, dude? That's... I wanna eat. Ready? If you can make it, and go far away. No, go far away. Keep going. You gotta make it in this basket. If this is the rules of our show, you make it in this basket, I will buy it for you. You gotta go further back, bro. You're a disc golfer. Go ahead. <gasps> nope, you don't get it. It's mine. Buying this for 10 bucks. And in the end, what a unique, different experience. You got a giant blockbuster sign. You think this is a big thing. A giant Salvation Army sign. I got like Chippendale Rescue Ranger stuff, t-shirts, Page Master stuff. Ricky got that Coca-Cola telephone clock thingy. Oh, and, yeah, and I took boy. a trip to the car. I can't even remember what it was. How are we gonna fit in here? Is this what we're doing? This yes. is, we're doing this the way home. Let me get in. Okay. I'm so glad we're, we're traveling in luxury here in Arkansas. This is what I pictured Arkansas like. Don't eat the car! Only the best for our Pistol oh, Game Squad God. guests. Oh. Perfect. Last thing. We completely forgot about the challenge. Ricky, where are we on our way to today while we're being, oh gosh, while we're smuggled in the back of Retro Rick's car. So we're going to Retro Rick's storage unit. This to is gonna be amazing. Now uh, we're on our way to the storage unit. Let's go. All right, today's video is Ricky and I oh, going through Retro Rick's storage locker in hopes of buying things. So Rick, Ricky, oh he, oh, he came out this way. Ricky, you all right over there? We did, oh, he's coming through the top. We're hunting in your storage locker. I'm excited to buy stuff from you, bro. Was it comfortable back here? Uh, no, it was extremely <laughs> uncomfortable. I'm gonna be honest with you. Hey, now you get to hunt my stuff. Yeah! Bro, bring it on in, bring it on in, bring it on in. Come on, he's the sign guy. Hey, pasale, pasale, sign over here. <laughs> oh boy. How much for the NES stack? Ricky That's never sick. saw that. Isn't that sick? It's got all of them. It's got a hook and Peter Pan and Rufy. Oh. oh! 
Ricky, it looks like he has two of those talk boys. You might need to make an offer on one of them, Ricky. If there's two of them. Roller blade racer. You gotta throw up some gameplay on this thing. It's funny, we never see this cart around ever. And randomly in the last place I went with Rick, we found a bunch of these at a convention. We were like, dude, we've never seen this game. And we found it like 10 times just at this place. Awesome game, by the way. I think I'm gonna buy this off Rick right here. I gotta buy this off Rick. I'm gonna buy this off Rick. I'm gonna say that I'm buying this off Rick right now for $10. Mark my words, $10. Ooh, look at that, Ricky. Put that cookie down. Let my wife cookies. <laughs> Trying to find a gentleman doll. Me too. All right, let's see. Game after game after game after game. Oh, right here. Great combo pack right there. Another Super C. Do I need Super C? No, I have a Super C. I don't need another Super C. I got too many Super Cs. Let's see what's in this bag. ET stuff? Let's go. Oh, look at this puppy book. Is Rick yelling down there? What? What you say to me, man? That's my hook happened in this way! Ruby O! So Rick never made a video about this yet, but uh, I, I knew he got this a while ago. But Rick... Wow. Tell them what this, this is, is down here. This is the Nintendo, I think Macy's or different retail store displays. This is the glass top. So this is not the Nintendo. The world of Nintendo, Nintendo ones like we have. You thought it was. Yeah. You're like, oh, and that's, what we that's have. the bottom. I'm like, no, no, no. This is the glass display top that apparently these are super rare. It's, wow. It's awesome. That's awesome, dude. I love it. So you, are you gonna make a video on it sometime, maybe? At some point, me and Adam ended up shooting some footage of it, but it's like three minutes long, so I'm not, I'm not 100% sure what to do with it. Adam. I know, noob over here. We got some uh, some consoles lying around that I need. There's VHS back here, but I, I don't think I can dig an, oh, the Atari Jaguar. Rick, how much for the Atari Jaguar in box? It's, it's literally in there. How much? How much, I said? I don't even think I have the price on it. 500, 400? Is that what it's at? Yeah. Uh, I don't know, I might have to get it. Let me see. I don't know, dude. Let me see in here. We can work something out. Yeah, we can work something out. I don't I, want to I, work something out, but we can I work edit for you, I got t-shirts for you, you know. Uh, wow. I made, oh. a, I made a meme for you. I'm sick of it. I've heard it for two years. No one else has heard that I made for my son. Uh oh! Look at that, bro! What's this, dog? The Atari Jack with all the stuff? Wow, why dude. Don't at, uh, why, don't, why, don't, why don't you look it up, Ricky? I have no idea. So, it's a CIB Jaguar. The Atari Jaguar is one oh, of those yeah, consoles. Yeah, <laughs> it's one of those consoles that I constantly would see commercials for as a kid constantly but never this in the turbo graphic 16 always saw the commercials never yep. felt the need to pull the trigger but i was always so enthralled it reminded me of something so like wild. from twilight zone like the the little martians that come by the little invaders remote, yeah. yeah it reminded me of like you made this in the 70s to look cool my very first video game i ever bought i bought a jaguar console in the 90s for three dollars wow at a auction and I sold it on eBay for like $40. Wow. And it, I had to get like a money order. Like there was no, you know, credit cards or anything on eBay. This is the 90s. Wow. And I sold, was, this was what started me selling stuff. I actually have a crazy Jaguar story too. One time I was in the African savanna and I saw a Jaguar. A formidable creature is at large. Rick's over here looking up what a Jaguar is worth. The the last, both, the last two both sold for 550. I mean, if you want to sell it or are willing to, we could just, it doesn't have to be cash. We can work it out. T-shirts plus cash. I'm in. We'll do it. We'll figure it out. In? Box Jaguar? I guess. Okay. I walked by that earlier thinking it was something different, but you're saying it's that freaking expensive vintage Bill and Ted set? Dude, it's got speakers on it, so you, you plug it into your uh, yeah. Walkman back then, I guess. Wow. But That's, look, how cool is that? I actually got that on Whatnot on a toy show. All real monsters. Ah! Nice cash, bro. What are you, a disc golfer? All these old Ren and Stimpy's sticker sets, but they're still in the, in the they're still sealed like as one. Wow. I got the coolest crap. Oh, stop it. Look at those McDonald's cards. Oh yeah, let me see those. I gotta take these out here so I can see them better. Ronald McDonald? I know that guy. The Adventures of Ronald McDonald, the McDonald's 500. <laughs> what are these? Stone protectors. In box? This yeah. is all, ooh, with the KB toys on it? You know so I don't ever see and the vehicles, let alone, you know, brand Did you get this for a good deal? I did, I got these also on Whatnot for like eight bucks a piece. What? So if you think Whatnot, you guys are crazy. Whatnot's amazing. Yeah. It's a oh, Vectrex. Oh shoot. But it's in like this. You have a Vectrex? It's in the, look, look at the back. This is the thing that's, this is the Bring thing that's out. hard. Oh my God. Bring it, Bring it out. out. Bring it out. The Vectrex is a console, but it is a console that you've never seen a console look like as far as graphically. The way they utilize the, the console itself and the components inside. Obviously you can tell I don't know exactly how to explain it. It has this crazy, almost like in your face, like coming out of the screen, almost like feels like somewhat of a 3D without actually being 3D. Yeah. 
yeah. graphic style. And it, but this is the thing that's that I I don't know if it's like a like a rental case or what it is, but this is hardly ever seen. And then this is a multi cart that I think he said had every game on it. That wow. So yeah, we got this from a guy. This guy I got this from the guy that uh, the GameCube kiosk, McDonald's kiosk. Oh, that's right. Oh, I remember that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we call this like the Pizza Hut box. <laughs> this is a little mini, like, portable TV. Huh? But what's cool about this, we've been looking forever for one of these. It actually has uh, AV on one of the sides. Wow. Like, you never see it. So it's colored, awesome. and this is this is dead stock. <laughs> and, yeah, we were like, we want to hook up a PS5 to this. Oh, that'd be awesome. Wouldn't that be cool? That'd be like, great. Like, my converter? Yeah. Winning tips for Sega Genesis. Ricky, you know how good you could be at the Sega Genesis? Dude, with these tips, I'll be unstoppable. You'll be so good at Mean Bean Machine and Toe Jam and Earl. Bro, I- Mortal, you could do an Adukin. I can do a Raiden. It's Dang. not called doing a Raiden, Ricky. It's called doing- <laughs> Read this, wear my vest, the, you know, the, the Genesis counter, and I, I could be legit. And with your, uh, with no. your statues around you. If you had the vest on, you wouldn't need that, That's Ricky. right, Ricky. <laughs> Let's be real. We don't need any of this. <laughs> what is wrong with us? I'm, I have a whole storage unit for my crap. We're gonna try to make a deal. I'm actually missing Mario Paint. So I'm gonna see if Hey man, sure. Uh, what about whatever it's going for, I'll sell it to you for half of what it's going for. Nice. nice. Time to find the lowest underpriced listing <laughs> online. What's it sell for, Ricky? 36, 39, 49, 38, 39. It's, it's like, I would say, Forty-ish dollars. $18, Ricky. You're gonna buy it for $18? Bro, slip him a cool 20. So, baby. All right, that's it. Fun day, buying lots of stuff. Too much stuff, too much. Bro, take it easy with my camera, bro. Hey guys, be gentle. For my sins.